Hello everybody, this is Theron. Welcome to Minecraft LAN Party. Ow! That was dumb. Oh, I can't see grass growing in here. Um, yeah, it looks like VexFX has been by. Left a little present up on the top. Oh, hi, little dolphins. Oh, look at this. Look at this underwater seascape. Ah, it's so pretty. Nice. It's not a puffer fish, is it? No, it's just a cod. Oh, this is neat. Uh, let's go check. Oh, hang on. I bet you there's a flower down here, too. Or I'll be very disappointed. Hi, dude. Really? Huh. That sounds neat. Oh, there's all kinds of them. I thought I looked this up with the, the pickles. Okay. Uh, so, yeah. Looks like VexFX at least has been by. Let's go check and see what the sales situation is. Let's go down. Oh. Fixer upper tridents. No, no takers at one diamond each. Oh. Look at this. I sold one for. Oh, more than the stack of diamonds. Oh, oh, oh. And, oh, oh, look at this. Oh, okay, half a stack of diamonds. Okay. Ah, uh, that's, okay. I sold tridents. I need to restock. I also need some riptide. I need to make some riptide tridents. Uh, I've been working on that. I've got some more. Wherever they are. I've got, I got a thing full of tridents here. But uh, we'll work on that in a bit. I just wanted to check and see if I made sales. And I did. That's a bunch of diamonds. I'm that's that's super happy. Um very cool. Let's uh while I'm out here, let's go check the iron farm. And then there's something I need to show you over at my base. Burning iron golems. And a bunch of iron. So uh, I still haven't quite sorted out exactly what it is that causes this to sort of stay loaded, but it does. I'm not complaining exactly. Uh, there we go. 47 blocks of iron. Not bad. And we've got a good number here, so that adds it fills up another another stack of iron blocks. Pretty cool. Um, yeah. So I happen to know that uh, it was Barb Bakes Things that bought the tridents. Because uh, she has not been able to gather that many on her own. And I've kind of kept the location of the drowned farm uh, a bit of a secret. It's not, I'm not, I don't intend to keep it secret. I just wanted to kind of get it up and running. I'll go and put in a portal and we will uh, make it accessible to others. But I wanted to get a, a good stock of tridents in the shop. For people to be able to take advantage of, because I've got plenty. Um, I, I I now have. Uh, I think I've gotten one more since I last showed you. Plop. So, I need to. I need to enchant up a few more. I don't remember there being a pile of dirt there next to that tree, but. There are torches on it, so it's got to be natural. That's weird. Okay, let's go downstairs, and I have something something weird's been going on down there, and it's just kind of it's kind of weird. I don't have oops ah um, don't have a ton of time this evening to uh, to record stuff, but did want to show a couple of things, and. Uh, And and uh, make sure that I caught them on on camera. Ow! Uh, so yeah, 
Barb makes things bought a couple of tridents, which is awesome. I, I very much appreciate it. And actually, I could probably switch over to like charging emeralds uh, because that's the real that's the real cost. Oh, hey, Mr. Slime, how did you uh, spawn in there? You must have spawned on that uh, torch there. You're pushing David S. Pumpkins around. Okay. How are you doing? All right. He's been over there for over a year, and I haven't come up with anything to do with him. Ooh, I got another scoot. Very nice. Oh, that's just such a mess. And see how, like, these feet are above these feet? I think one of the, I think there's still eggs there, and I think... One of those uh, turtles is still pregnant. And I see the accidental iron farm is still on, under operation. I got a bunch of melons there. Okay, the weird thing I wanted to show you is going on here. Oh, so notice how there's two mine carts on each of these rails? Yeah, that wasn't, that wasn't the case. They were... The, the mine carts were coming down and they were stopping somewhere around here and they would just go and they would just stop and then I break the mine cart place it again and it would and it would go and it would just stop there and the rails are powered and there's no good reason um, I think I figured out what was going on um, and it's fascinating and I think I think the mine carts duplicated at least one of them did and let's see if I put down if I pick up these and put these down oh man okay oh so I think one of the mine cards duplicated and oh, there we go and uh and but was invisible and it was just sitting there on the track and the other one was running into it and that's what happened and when i i broke some of the blocks down there hoping that i sort of you know actually fixed the problem and it didn't seem to so i just kind of like hmm, okay and i put it back underway and i oh hello come here okay thank you um so plop oh I have to get these out of here <clears throat> and uh when I came back the the mine cart had uh the mine carts had duplicated and saying there were two running on each track I'm not going to complain about free mine carts because I'm I am making them somewhat regularly for my villager harvesting operation but that's just it's kind of weird at least it seems a little weird to me but um now i don't know exactly why they might have duplicated i initially thought maybe it was a chunk boundary thing and one of the chunks it was entering a chunk that was getting unloaded or or vice versa but the chunk boundaries right here and it was definitely over here where it happened so something something goofy something goofy happened don't know what um and and the minecart duplicated now i don't know if let me clear these out just so i can make sure that everything's still working so if there, if I see some sugar cane in one of the chests later, it'll, it'll be fine. Uh, it would be interesting if I could duplicate that and actually have some stuff in the hopper and see if it would allow you to duplicate items. Don't know if it's a Minecraft thing. Don't know if it's a spigot thing. Not sure. It's just weird. So I'll just keep my eye out on it to see if it happens again. Um, hi, David. It did not happen over here, so I still only got one minecart over here. I'll take these. Um, so this is that, but this is a much shorter track. I mean, those over there are twice as many sugarcane plants. So I don't know. It's really weird. Um, so anyway, that is 
I think the bulk of what I wanted to show. Um, yeah, I need to get back to sort of culling these guys because they are pretty, I think they're completely bred up and I don't know how many of them are. There are because the village info uh, plugin no longer works with this version of Minecraft or Spigot, but I need to check that because there may be an updated version by now. I haven't been doing too much. I've just been spending time at the Trident Farm. And now that I have some more emeralds and a bunch of diamonds, we can, uh, I should chant up some more of those, the, oh, somebody borrowed some sugar cane, it looks like. Okay, that's a fine. Um, <clears throat> so now that I have more supplies here, because you go through go through those uh, emeralds quickly doing that kind of enchanting especially because I don't have a loyalty 3 guy I don't think I think my best loyalty is loyalty 1 or maybe it's riptide one of them I only have a level 1 and so I have to get 4 books and combine them to get a level 3 riptide 1 no he's been depreciated though um, paling five channeling there's only one level uh, yeah it's up here maybe I don't remember I don't remember where he is oh look here's a sign that has a bad character huh I need to replace that figure it out Riptide 1. So Riptide goes up to level 3, and this is the best one. It takes 4 books, so it's 48 emeralds, in order to get a Riptide 3 book. So that's why I really haven't really done any Riptide tridents in the shop. Uh, just because it's expensive. Um, and I don't... Let me find those tridents. Let's take a look. Ice, packed ice... Where did I put them? Trident, here we go. And here's my books and stuff. So tridents, I've been trying to get up some more. I've got these that all actually have enchants on them already. And then this guy is completely dead, almost completely dead. And then I've got these that are just plain. So I wanna get some more. I can put some more of these into the shop and then I should uh, enchant up some of the others so i have four riptide one books which is cool that'll that'll help um and then so that will let me make one of them but that it's just expensive and then to combine those onto a book is going to take let's see how much that takes how many levels that takes i've got 110 levels now so Riptide 1 and Riptide 1 makes Riptide 2, costs 4. And I assume the right thing to do is to, yeah, is to turn these into a Riptide 2 book. Another 4, so that's 8. And then that's 8. So 16 levels, that's not too bad. So... 48 emeralds and 16 levels. It's not too bad. So anyway, that's it. I need to work on getting some more tridents, getting some riptide tridents enchanted, and yeah, and trying that. I had a thunderstorm kick up while I was at the trident farm, at the, the drowned farm, and I couldn't... Uh, I tried to use the, the riptide trident that I had on one of the on one of the drowned and I couldn't get it to work and it probably I thought I heard a weird noise uh, I'm guessing that uh, because they were covered up by the cover over the top of the farm that it didn't work and when whatever it is that you're hitting with the channeling trident 
maybe needs to have sky access in order to work. Okay. Oof. Okay, diamonds. Yeah, another ten stacks and another six diamonds. So these are these are proceeds from the shop. I'll put these down here. Very nice. I've got plenty of diamonds. Uh, emeralds. How am I on emeralds? Emeralds are probably. I actually have plenty of emeralds too. I don't know what I'm talking about. Never mind me. Vroom vroom vroom. Okay. Oh, it's nighttime. Let me go to bed. I don't think I have anything else to show right now. Um, I did, in addition to Barb makes things buying tridents. Uh, what was that? Somebody took damage. Uh, VexFX came over and he was, he was in the shop and he, uh, he did something pretty clever. I, I swam up. I flew up to it. And there were dolphins inside the fishbowl, which, ah, um, which I had thought about doing, and and uh, I was kind of happy to see that you know, oh hey, dolphins in the fishbowl, um, and they were swimming around there doing the thing, and he named them. That was cool. The way he got them in was uh, through here. <laughs> He broke a couple, he broke some of the glass and dragged them in down here and they came up uh, through the bubble column. But then he was on and we were, we were sort of talking about stuff and, oh, the way he dragged them in was he put leads on them. I didn't realize you could put leads on dolphins. Now, originally they were going to make it so you could ride dolphins. And then there was a whole upcry. It's like, oh, that's, that's like cruelty to dolphins so they removed it so i'm kind of surprised they left that you can put dolphins on a lead and you can drag them around but anyway so while we were on and we were kind of going over what we he was doing at the cove which he's been aqua aqua forming the area at the cove a little bit too. Um, oh, and he showed me how the fishing farm works. So the cove area here. Bloop. So he put a conduit out here. He went out and treasure map hunting and he found some stuff and he got himself enough stuff to build um, a conduit, which is cool. And then, uh, Uh-oh. And I guess I'm in fire out here. Oh. Nice. Okay. Uh, so anyway, I think the, the cove area looks really cool. You put some sea pickles. It's all great. We can come in for a landing. Plop. And he did show me... showed me how this worked and I was doing it wrong oh hello um so that's cool not a lot of extra stuff we have, we have a couple things oh that's just an awesome book anyway so, so that's cool We're, uh, things are coming along here I do like it doesn't take a lot of effort to make these underwater areas look cool. Oh, hi, Mr. Chicken. But, uh, yeah. So this is, uh, this is pretty good. I like the, uh, I like this area now. So anyway, <clears throat> I mean, it was cool before, but it, it's, it, it looks, it looks right. It looks like underwater area in a pirate cove now. So anyway, I think that's all. Did I? I thought I heard a zombie here. No, it's just villagers. Anyway, that's it. That's all I've got to show you. This is, uh, thanks for watching. Oh, hello, Mr. Dolphin. Oh, Dolphin's Grace. It, it's a little overboard. If you ask me.
That's weird. I was able oh I was able to take off out of the water before. Huh. Okay. Don't know. Anyway, that's it. Thanks for watching. This is Theron. It's been Minecraft Land Party. And I will see you next time. Alright, bye.